All right, guys, so we have a trail update for you. Um, as we were walking up towards the North Carolina border, we will, you wanna film in, Julie? Yeah, so I'm gonna tell you what happened, okay. So, well, should I start about a few days ago? Yeah, just talk about what you're, you know, what you're, yeah, whole, so what you told me. My experience out here has been great. Like I love the AT, um, and I had a great time in 2019, and it's been a wonderful few days. But I just been having this nagging feeling, like it's not right. It's not a good feeling to be out here. It doesn't feel safe to me, and um, I've just been getting like little hints to get off trail, like when, like. I don't know. It's just not the same. It's not the same type of feeling like I had last time. Basically what, you know, a couple things that we've, we've had was, um, when we got to Neil Gap, that poor guy who got bit up by rats, I think that was like one thing that, was that, creepy, that yeah. creeped you out. Um, then when, as soon as we came out of Neil Gap, there was a guy saw uh, a rattlesnake, a rattler, which we didn't see. <laughs> Which I've seen, I've seen, yeah. I've seen rattlesnakes all the time. Those don't bother me. Yeah. But um, a guy, a, a guy one. almost stepped on one. Then the next day, a guy gets helicoptered out from getting bit by a rattlesnake. Um, people are nice on trail. We met some really cool people, but then there's also like some odd people, and I. And when, most, most which, are which nice. there's always like yeah, yeah most of them are nice but it's just a different crowd of people than well what 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 triggered you the, I, what triggered you the most was the shuttle driver that just dropped us off right? yeah so it triggered, what did he say yeah so we got we got a shuttle um shuttle driver you showed the cars and everything yeah right? yeah um yeah he just said that there's creepy people out here um, that there's a lot of people that were out of jail, got out of jail, I guess, the past year in Virginia, year in Virginia, or Virginia. New York, yeah. and there's a lot of homeless, more homeless than normal, and more um, prisoners out on trail, and it's just a different type, it's a different trail. Yeah. And, you know, when he said that, like, it kind of reinforced, like, the feelings I've been having the couple, last few days, like, it, it's not like anyone, like, I felt like on unsafe around them there's just like more odd people out and i don't mean to be judgmental or anything it's just but it makes me feel unsafe um and you know yeah that's that's it and you know i'd love to do this trail i think i could i it's not a physical thing like i feel fine like it, this is the first time i came out of trail and like i didn't have a hiker hobble i can't even remember that ever happening on the first three hikes but like it's more mental like it's just it doesn't feel right. Plus, I haven't seen my family in like two years, and I just got to see them right before we came here. And I just feel so guilty, like being out here and not spending time with my family. Yeah. So. Okay, guys. So I don't know what what the decision is. It's not like 100% final. I still have the possibility of hiking by myself. Um. But that's not what I came out here to do. It was supposed to be both of us mm -hmm. enjoying the AT. So I don't really know what's gonna happen. This this might be the end of this this year's AT, and it kind of sucks. <laughs> it was only um, I'm sorry, Steve. three days or whatever. But you know, it's not Julie's fault. It's just the way the trail is. I mean, yeah, yeah. Like I don't want anyone. Like I'm sure. It's fine. The trail it's is fine. fine, but it's just like these little it, things that kind of yeah, pop up. Yeah, it's know? fine. Like people, you're quit, out in the wilderness. People though. quit things all the time, and yeah. it's okay to get a feeling and go with your gut and feel like, okay, yeah. this doesn't feel right. Yeah. You know, we wanted it to feel right. We wanted it, but it just doesn't. Yeah. I mean, does that feel? Do you feel that way, or is it just me? Um, like for me, I think I've I've already done it twice. So one thing I was what i was getting out of it was just a different scenery different type of trail different you know just a different uh time of the year and i was really enjoying it but um i also think i don't know i feel i feel i feel safer on trail than anywhere but it's just like um 
you know, I like, usually do too. Yeah. But the, when I when I, when I saw <laughs> when I saw the person being airlifted, and what happened there, he was like bushwhacking or whatever, you know, and like, you know, stuff like that can happen to anybody. It's there's not it's not a reason to quit over, but it's just like a bunch of things kind of like popping up at once. So. Combined. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's it is it is what it is. It's basically you know, what well, we can treat this as a section. Um, we had a fun 69 point something miles or whatever it was yeah, to it was Hiawassee. Fun. And, we had uh, some great sunrises. Yeah. We met a hiker named Rick who's super cool. Yeah. So, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's been interesting and, uh, not really sure where else I can go with this, but that's kind of what's, what's up right now. And, yeah. Uh, okay. Bye. All right, bye. All right, Julie, what are you doing with your zero day? Um, so the lady gave us a little map of the town. I really want to check out this seafood place down mm -hmm. the street. So I'm kind of hungry. All right, let's go. Yeah. Let's go check out Hiawassee. Hiawassee. I'm back at the room. There's the pack that I probably won't be using for my through hike anymore. Yeah. That's not funny. It's just not the right year, man. There's Julie's pack. Um, we got all this food, too. I wasted all this money on food. Mm. Here's our view. But now we have snacks for like. All right, let's check out Hiawassee. Yeah, it's like a little mini Gatlinburg. We even got the coaster now. Oh, wow. The coaster's only been there for a couple of years. But... This is so cute. This is really, really cute. Yeah, it's super we'll cute. Have I've seen it in videos, but you never see it in, in videos until, you know, you can't tell exactly what it is until you actually see it. Like, it cool. and a river. It's got an NOC feel That's to it. That's the Chattahoochee. Oh, okay. It's got it like an NOC the feel. Coaster. Like the oh. They take you up to the top uh -huh. and then you ride your own cart down, just like oh. the one in Gatlinburg. Oh, wow. All right, guys, just got dropped off great by Grace. Super cool shuttle driver yeah. in Gainesville. Um, yeah, we're going to walk around. I'll film a little bit. I mean, we'll walk around here. We got our train comes at like 9. Yeah. So, Not yeah. PM. Yeah, so this is Gainesville. This is a you know, people get off here from the train, and then they go to Amicalola. So we're back here, back to where we started. Um, yeah, we'll just we'll see what what this town's all about. There's a little bike trail we can check out. Yeah.
the pink color is cool. Back to where we started. Yeah, in Jersey. Este sábado es pan de Magdalena. Allá nos vemos. Sí, ya está. All right, guys. It's like the best part of New Jersey, the pork roll. Mm -hmm. Right, Julie? Mm -hmm. Coffee. Yeah, coffee's good.